A stripper in Gainesville is now suing the attorney general and others over a measure she claims violates her constitutional rights. Local 10's Calvin Hughes is joining us live in the newsroom with more on the bill met to combat human trafficking. Well, the new state law is meant to protect young people against human traffickers, as you just mentioned, and Governor Ron DeSantis signed it earlier this year, but a new lawsuit says the mandate goes too far, stepping on adult entertainment workers' First Amendment rights. 19-year-old Serenity Michelle Bushy worked at Cafe Risque outside Jacksonville up until this month. In a more than 80-page lawsuit, she claims a new law raising the age requirement for her profession lost her her job. So you got a stripper suing the state of Florida, man, because they passed the law that's saying you have to be 21 or older, 21 or older to strip. Now... Obviously, this 19-year-old was getting money, <laughs> obviously, right? But, like, I guess they're trying to combat, you know, sex trafficking and all those other things. But s some people just like that lifestyle, bro. Quick money, you know. I don't know, bro. I, I don't know. And is now violating her First Amendment right to express herself. She writes that at least eight others and the performers at Cafe Risque lost their jobs because of the new law, too. That's in addition. Damn. They had a lot of little young tenderonies in there stripping. Nine people between the ages of 18 and 20. Sheesh. To cooks waitresses, barbacks, DJs, and security personnel that can't work at the establishments. Cafe Risque, a Jacksonville strip club, and a Jacksonville area lingerie store are also joining in the lawsuit filed against the Attorney General, saying that the law is broad and the legislature didn't consider a less restrictive regulation. They write, the law unreasonably burdens speech without measurably advancing any significant governmental interest, adding plaintiffs have a right to associate with adults of their own choosing. That's facts, though including the right to employ and contract with those adults. The legislature intended the law to curb human trafficking. They claim performers are subjected to engage in sex trade and even trafficking with customers, managers, owners, and workers at establishments. The legislature says restricting the employment for performers under 21, quote, furthers an important state interest of protecting those vulnerable individuals from sex trafficking, drug abuse, and other harm. And state lawmakers... And you know, when you go in these strip clubs, bruh, some strippers be straight, but you know, you could, if you look at their eyes, bruh, they shit be going, both of their eyes, one go left, one go right, bruh. You know, indicating that they're a victim of some crime, like some kind of, I don't want to even say it, but like. Yeah, all strippers not right, man. And this this law right here is trying to help that. But, you know, people want to do what they want to do. Despite the income that may come about. You feel me? So. Hey, man. Shout out to the 19-year-old who's standing up for herself. And all the other strippers that she trying to help. <laughs> but let me know what y'all think about this story, man.